Hey, Arts Emerson fam and fans, Esperanza Spalding here, just celebrating the fact that we're entering the season. And I'm so grateful that our project with Wayne Shorter, Frank Gehry, Liliana Blaine Cruz, Iphigenia is going to premiere and launch and blossom into the world through the season alongside all the other marvelous, glorious creators who are sending their magic through the portals of Arts Emerson. So we'll see you there. Thank you for the love and support. Keep shining. You can no longer play along with the part you've been prescribed to play. I mean, I've been hearing that melody for five years. And I remember Wayne saying early on, oh, that's Iphigenia, that's, that's her voice coming through. Wayne Shorter is combination uh, muse, guide, mentor, and guru. The theme of Iphigenia really came from Wayne's imagination and Wayne's heart. What I see in this myth is something very universal, which is the struggle between potency, power, and voice of an individual in a context that's more powerful than them. And their melodies. No, no. doing a lot of our thinking and devising and planning on opposite sides of the country. I was mainly in New York and Boston, and Wayne was in Los Angeles. Our investigating of this character met each other <laughs> in the writing itself. We both were writing too fast for the other to keep up because we were both in this furious, <laughs> inspired relationship with this myth. Every being involved found another dimension of their creative strategy. It facilitated this kind of eruptive ingenuity. Every aspect of how we're doing this, the story we're telling, the way we're telling it, we're really trying to challenge who writes the reality and who plays out the reality that becomes our everyday and becomes our history, becomes our myth. 